Hey guys, today I'm going to share with you five productivity hacks that help me to get more done. So my first productivity hack is find your golden hours. Everyone is quite different, so some people are very good in the mornings, some people are very good in the evenings, but either way, you generally have at least a two to three hour block where you're more productive and you get more done. What you need to do is find out what those hours are for you. Personally, I do very well in the morning, so I block important tasks from 5am till 7am, they're my golden hours where my productivity's through the roof, I don't get distracted, no one else is up, it's a little bit darker, and a little bit cooler in Bali. So yeah, have your most important tasks set for your golden hours where you're actually more productive, you're more alert. Tip number two is don't multitask. Stick to one task at a time. It's very easy to try and do two things at once, try and think it's gonna help speed up the process. But it's been shown by neuroscience that it actually tires the brain by having to switch from one task to another, it's mentally draining, and you end up getting less than as a result. What you need to do is stick to one task at a time and block your time for that task. So say you had to write a blog post, you would spend an hour or whatever, however long it takes just doing that blog post and then you move on to a different task. Don't try to do too many things at once. It, you might think it's gonna get more done, but it works out the opposite way around. Tip number three is use cold showers. Personally, I use them as soon as I wake up or I use them before I've gotta do an important task just to shock my body into life. Or if I don't want to take a shower, I can take a pool pop. There's loads of research coming out showing the benefits of cold exposure. Uh, just for productivity though, it's generally going to release endorphins. It makes you feel more alert as your blood circulates in. And when you're feeling low in energy or you just can't wake yourself up, have a cold shower and guarantee it's going to snap you into life. Tip number four would be exercise. Now, exercising daily has been shown to have incredible amounts of productivity benefits for the long term. What I want to advocate in this video is short exercise, short little bursts of exercise. So personally, when I wake up in the morning, sometimes I can't wake myself up. What I do is I do 15 burpees or 15 press ups, gets the heart rate going, it really shocks your body into life and kind of gets you out of that morning slump. Sometimes when I'm trying, I want to get, get some work done, I want a task to do, rather than kind of procrastinating and trying to force myself to do it, I'll just do some pull-ups, I'll do some push-ups, all of a sudden my heart rate's going, I'm a bit more energetic and I'm more likely to get cracking with the task at hand. Tip number five would be don't get distracted, especially by social media, emails, etc. What you need to do is block out the distractions as much as possible. And the one way I found which is really helpful to do this is an app called Freedom. What you do is you download the app and it will come up with a little bar saying how many minutes of freedom would you like? You put a number, say you've got a task that's gonna take 60 minutes to do, you know you're gonna be checking Facebook and your emails, you just type in 60, and then for that 60 minutes, you cannot access the internet no matter what. This is great for when you're doing any writing, any editing, anything where it's just you and the task and you don't wanna get sidetracked. You've locked that time in and you can't actually get out of it until the, the time period is gone. So if you need the internet over that period, it's obviously not good for that kind of task, but a lot of tasks when you do actually just need to sit down and get cracking, it's great for those. If you like this video, let me know in the comments below. There'll be more videos coming from me soon.